Okay, shh, we're, we're actually, we're actually live now. Go ahead. Achilles, Achilles Kaladita Korit Serem Kapre non podcast. I can't. Yeah, you're translating, not reading. Okay, Achilles. Yeah, Korit. Achilles runs. Runs quickly, maybe quickly. runs up quickly. Yeah, runs quickly, but. Non potest. But he desires not he to. He is do. not able. Wait, yeah, he is not able to. To capere, to capture. To capture. Him. Okay. So Achilles uh, runs up, but he is not, runs quickly, but is not able to capture him. Ter kirkumorus fugit. Three times. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, I'm sorry. Fugit Hector. Fugit Hector. Three times he. Who's who's fleeing? Hector. The nominative case Hector. Right. Three times Hector. Flees. Kirkum uh, Moris. Yeah. What does that mean? Kirkum. What's Kirkum? Anybody? Circle. Circle. Have you learned? That? Or here, probably around. Circles. Circles around. Around. Three times okay. he flees around the wall. Okay, tandem resistit. But for a long time. At last, tandem. Oh, yeah. But at last. He resists. He resists. Say where tit. Now, we can he just turns. train. You could say he turns himself. Yeah. He turns or you can just say more simply he turns. He turns. And now be careful and of Achilles. the ending. Uh, we want Achilles to be doing something. But why can't Achilles be doing something in the sentence? Because he's accused of meaning he receives the action. Good job. So he, somebody, he, meaning Hector, wokat akilem in Pugna. Oh, so Hector. Yeah, he, Hector. Calls Achilles, Achilles in Pugna. In, in battle. In, maybe into, because in plus the accusative is into. Into battle. Good job. Do uh, you want to do one more sentence? Yeah. Okay. Ile. Now, remember, in Latin, if the subject changes, we have a pronoun. If the subject continued, if it, if it kept being Hector, um, then uh, it, there'd be no pronoun. But you have ille to show you the subject changes. So the previous sentence, it was Hector. So now who's, who's the subject? Previous sentence is Hector. Now who's the subject? Uh, Achilles. Which say he meaning Achilles. Ile conicit. Uh, I'm sorry. Ile procedit. Proceeds. Pro goes forward. He proceeds, and th that's he, right? Yeah, and he conicit. He hurls. And he hurls. His hasta. Anybody? Spear. Spear. Oh. In hectorem. Now, uh, in plus accusative often means into, but, but in battles it means against. But he Hector avoids the spear. Uh, but Hector avoids. But we forgot that previous one. He hurls his he, he hurls his spear toward Hector, against Hector, to Hector. Uh, but Hector avoids the spear. Okay, good job. Okay, uh, there was a question about in in hectorem. In, in battles and military context is best turns as against. So he hurls his, uh, his spear against Hector. Now you can make nicer English out of that. I'm sorry? Well, what's a better way to say it? Really? At Hector. At Hector. At Hector. OK, good. Uh, another volunteer. OK, so we're back. Day in day, Hector hastam koniki. Uh, then Hector hurls the spear. Good job. No, p pause. Everybody's good? Okay, keep going. At Achilles, now we're going to learn this <coughs> next chapter. The uh, Parmam Achilles, the shield of Achilles. That's the possessive form we learn next. Okay? So just trust me, it means Achilles' shield. Uh, so go ahead. So Hector hurls, but, uh, and? And strikes uh, the shield of Achilles. You got it, and strikes the shield of Achilles. Excellent. Any questions? OK, said Achilles in columis est. Uh, but Achilles is safe. Yeah, Achilles is unharmed. Excellent. Uh, nam, now this is the thing I'm most concerned with. Parma, what case is parma? Nam, the meaning it's what? It's the subject. So make sure you translate it that way. 
How do I, now remember, Achilles' armor is very special. His mommy had Vulcan make it for him. Uh, uh, because Why? Because Hector had taken his uh, armor as booty. Remember? Can I say that on YouTube? Nope. Yeah, no. Uh, remember, because his friend Patroclus had been killed, so Patroclus had been, uh, 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 Hector took the armor as booty, so Achilles now needs new armor. So this is really super, this is Anga Banga Danga armor. <laughs> okay. Oh, we'll define that later. Not on YouTube. Okay, so go ahead. Uh, go ahead. Translate it, please. Um, for the shield saves him. Yeah, you got it. For the shield saves Aum, him. And that's a word from an awful long time ago, like chapter 2 or 3 or something. Make sure you know it. Yeah. Okay, awesome. Uh, could you do maybe do one more sentence? You can do the next I can do the whole thing if you want. Okay, awesome. Uh, then Achilles hurls a spear with all his might. Good. Hold on, Shh, gentlemen, please. Achilles hurls the spear with all his might, and Hasam is accusative. Everybody sees it. Okay. And uh, now, same thing. Hasta is. Shh, hold on, please. Hasta is nominative. Make sure you translate that as the subject. Yes. The hasta per auram uh, wolat. Wolat hasta per auram. The spear flies through the air and Good. pierces Hector. And pierces Hector. Ile kadidateram uh, mortuus. Ile kadidateram mortuus. Hector falls to the ground and. Oh, no. Hector yeah, falls to the ground. Yeah, he meaning dead. Hector, right. Excellent. He falls to the ground. Dead. Excellent. Accorit Achilles et dirum facinus facit. Oh, can I say that on YouTube? Yeah. Facinus facit. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, that's a good name for a band, yeah? Facinus facit. Okay. Go ahead, please. Uh, um, up runs Achilles. And good. Shh, shh, please. Up runs Achilles. Good job. And, and he does a terrible deed. He does a terrible deed. Good. Now, what case is Hectorum mortuum? Accusative, meaning it's receiving the action. So go ahead, Tejas. Um, he ties the Ooh. dead Hector to the chariot and drags it around the walls of Troy. Good. He uh, ties the dead Hector to his chariot and drags him, it, around. Right? Latin is way more concise. It doesn't repeat the him or the it. Um, it said it once, and it's good enough for the rest of the sentence. Okay, awesome. Pater et mater e mori spectant. His father and mother watch from the walls. You got it. Father and mother watch from the walls. Good. Hecuba clamant. Hecuba shouts. She says whatever that means. Um, oh, Achilles, cease from your wrath. You got it. Cease from your wrath. Ira. Good. Remember, that's what the books are about. That's what the Iliad is about, wrath. Uh, mene, right? Wrath. The wrath of Achilles, right? The wrath of Apollo, the wrath of, uh, of Agamemnon. Everybody has an attitude problem. Okay. Good. Um, at last. Yeah, it's time. Oh, time them, at last, yeah. Um, return to, return our son. To yeah, well, what does that look like? Red day, it looks like said day and blue day. What is, what is that form? That it's not the infinitive. Sede. That's the command. Good job. That's the that's the imperative. Mm -hmm. Yes. Why does it have to be the because the R E D is uh, a suffix. Re. The the suffix re gets a D very often, so you end up with red. Okay. Good. Uh, but Achilles said Achilles. No now and here's a word from a long time ago. What is it? A, um, that's like chapter three or four. You may have forgotten it. How you guys? Go ahead. Uh, but Achilles doesn't listen to her. Doesn't listen to her. Doesn't hear her. A, um, good job. Hectorem ad naves trahit. Now, uh, look at this. The subject continues. He doesn't, he, Achilles, doesn't hear her. If it continues to be Achilles, you don't get a pronoun. 
you have to provide it in your English translation. He drags. Yeah? He drags Hector. Um, uh, he drags Hector to the ships and okay. leaves him lying on the ground. And leaves him lying on the ground. Uh, lying is over here. Okay. Any questions? Questions? Okay, good.